What I'm doing on this drill is I'm going to use a back through dribble, which is a through the legs dribble, but instead of going from front to back, it's going from behind to in front. So I call this the back through dribble. And then I'm going to use a walk in the dog bounce going in the opposite direction of the normal walk in the dog. When the walk in the dog is actually two bounces. You dribble the ball from in front of you on the side of your body to behind you, as I'm doing here, and then you dribble from behind you to in front of you. So I'm cutting out that second part. I'm just using the front to back move on the side of my body and then I'm going back through with the dribble again. So I want to get some rhythm going. Once I pick up the rhythm, I'm going to pick up the speed. I want to keep that ball low and keeping it moving right in like an X motion you see going under the mid line of my body through the legs. So when I put this in slow motion going forward, you're going to get a better look at what I'm doing with my hands on the side of my body. See how I'm pushing it back from in front of me to behind me. And then I'm going under the legs and stepping forward. So once I get the rhythm, and once you get the rhythm, you can pick up your speed a little bit. Always find different ways to work on your handle. Find ways to challenge yourself. And of course, anytime you're working on your handle, you want to keep your eyes, head, and chest up so you can see the floor. You might have an open teammate. You might have a driving opportunity. You might see something in the defense. You might have an opportunity to score. But you got to be able to see the floor to pick up on these opportunities. Hit that thumbs up to like this drill. If you got any questions, leave me a comment. Work on your game. Dre all day. Yeah. This is Ivory Asamoah for Fort Worth, Texas. Work on your game.